All right, uh, what's up? So I'm I'm back making this quick video to show in South TV. Um, I want to show you how to prevent negative comments from getting on your YouTube channel. Now this only works on a laptop, computer, or desktop, whatever you have. I'm not sure if this works on the YouTube app or Studio app. I'm not sure. But if you want a um, <clears throat> laptop or desktop, then go to Video Management. And after you go to your video management, then this is going to pop up your video section of everything you upload it. So the next thing you want to go down to is your settings. And then all this all the stuff is going to pop up on the side. Uh, you want to go down to upload the faults. Now I would not recommend doing this because I'm not I never used this before, but I'm just showing you all like the steps of what's in here. So when you go over to advanced settings, um, and this does work, it just depends on what kind of videos you upload for the fall. So when you come over here, now I'm pretty sure y'all know what this is. This says allow all comments. This basically means your comment section is open to the public and they can say whatever they want, whether it's positive or negative. The next one down here, you can hold all inappropriate comments for review. So if, if, if it's something like inappropriate and you choose this as your settings, then YouTube will pick it up and they may find it inappropriate. So it's up to you if you want to pass certain comments on your YouTube channel so you can pick that. And the third one, it says hold all comments for review. For review. And this is the best one if you want to hold all comments for review because people always saying, I'm just going to disable my comments. Why would you want to disable your comments? Like, I don't like watching YouTube channels where I can't really leave my feedback on. The best thing you can do right here is to hold all comments for, you know, the review section. And if you like what somebody got to say, then you can pass the comment on your um, platform. But... A lot of people so busy working and going to school or doing whatever, they just mainly leave all the comments open to the public so people can say whatever they want. But the best one is to hold all comments for review, especially if you don't want trolls on your YouTube channel. This is the best one, so you want to pick this one. This is also available if you, if you like you uploading the video. When you're uploading the video, well, a lot of y'all upload videos. For all the people that upload YouTube videos and you do your own content, I'm pretty sure you're already familiar with this section right here. And it asks you if you want to allow all comments or hold inappropriate comments or you want to hold comments for review or you want to disable comments. So it's the, it's the same thing you upload in the video and it asks you if you want to leave it open or whatever. But um, I just want to let everybody know instead of disabling your comment section, you just can hold your comments for review because um, that'll really let people know, especially trolls, that your comments not getting no past my platform is not getting on my channel. So, um, if anybody's a content creator and you want to keep trolls off your YouTube channel, whenever you upload a YouTube video, you're going to come to a section that's going to ask you if you want to um, allow all comments or do whatever. Just pick this one. The third one is the best one. Just to hold all comments for review. Especially if you got friends on Facebook or Instagram, Snapchat, and you want your friends to leave feedback on your YouTube videos, then this one is the best one because this will keep all the trolls off your YouTube channel. Okay? So that's this is how you keep trolls off your YouTube channel. Alright? It's the best option right here. Alright y'all, that's the video and um I definitely see you on the next one, but uh yeah.